Good morning, Clinton, Indiana. This is your mayor, Joseph Richard, speaking. I'm talking to you today about an issue concerning our great town of Clinton. A local company called Treadstone Industries is in danger of being closed down by the Environmental Protection Agency. This is important to us because around 4,000 of our citizens are employed at this company. The EPA has informed me that the company has been producing too much sulfur dioxide. And if they keep producing this amount of sulfur dioxide, then they will be forced to close down. However, there is a solution. The solution is that they have to lower down, down their sulfur, di sulfur dioxide emissions. However, if they do this, it will be so expensive that they would have to cut 40 employees from their company in order to afford this new renovation. Now, we have decided that we have to keep this company open because of the fact that it employs 4,000 citizens from our city. Now, after this renovation is complete, 400 of them will have to be let go of the company. But that is still 3,600 citizens that are working in this company. But if 4,000 employees were to be cut from, cu cut from the company all at once, if the EPA were to shut it down, that means that 4,000 citizens in our town of Clinton, Indiana, would be unemployed. Now, this would be horrible for the economy, which in turn would make everyone upset. So as mayor, I am simply trying to keep as many people as I can happy. And because of that very reason, it is necessary that we in fact make these renovations so that the sulfur emissions of the company could be lowered. Now, the reason that Environmental Protection Agency thinks it is so important to lower that sulfur dioxide emissions is because sulfur dioxide is extremely unhealthy for people and for the environment. Once sulfur dioxide gets into our atmosphere, it reacts with the other gases that are present there. And when it does this, does this, it creates into fine particles. And once a lot of these fine, particle, fine particles are made, then a smog is created. Now, smog is similar to fog, upset smog is filled with dangerous toxins that could harm us and basically make and make vis and lower visibility extremely now if humans were to breathe if humans and other animals were to breathe in this sm smog then it would outline the lining of our lungs making it harder to breathe and basically giving us respiratory problems and it could even lead to diseases like asthma so we have decided to we have decided that it would be best to keep our company open, but to also fire the 400 people in order to create SO2 scrubbers, which could remove up to 95% of the SO2 that is currently being released in that atmosphere. Now this will be done because, because once the sulfur is burned, SO2 is created. Now once this SO2 is created, it will be sprayed by a mixture of limestone and water. Now this mixture will react with the sulfur dioxide creating water vapor, which is what you'll be seeing out of the chimneys from our factory starting soon. Now I hope you understand why it is necessary for us to fire those 400 workers, because if we would not have done this, then 4,000 workers would be unemployed, as well as our danger, as, as well as our health and our environment would be in a lot of danger.